What's up everyone, this is Save Knight and welcome back to Let's Play Home for the PC. The last episode I finished up that guy's basement or some kind of tunnel something under his house. I don't know what's going on with that. He had all these newspaper clippings about these murders and shit that happened like years ago and stuff and it's kind of weird and... You found a box of your old clothes that you threw out when you moved there. I also had, like, photos of you and Rachel and stuff. So that's kind of creepy. And, um, so yeah, that's, that was, like, really, really weird. And, um, I'm going on to some kind of uh, something. I suppose ventilation shafts. Maybe someone crawled through there. But it was too high up. But it was so high up that you must have been a sore landing. I like egg just thinking about it. There was dirt on the ground. It looked wet and there was grass smeared within it. Uh, there was similar dirt on my own shoes. Hmm. Uh, excuse me. Disgusting. It was a mess of filthy garbage bags. There were rips and tears in most of the bags. But it looked like an old videotape was sticking out. Did I take it? Yep. Because you're a nasty little pack rat. Wasn't sure what I hoped to discover with the tape, but I took it anyway. Door. I could hear a faint trickling sound like water. What was that? A kitchen knife covered in drying blood. Thinking about it made me sick. I didn't even want to touch it. Did I take it? Yeah, sure, why not? Slipped the knife into my boots since I had the gun in my pocket. Did I really need all this? Oh shit. God damn it. Door was locked. There was a musty smell from inside. A door with a one next to it. Get too far was that other way. There was a rusty ladder sunk into the water, which smelled disgusting. I know I couldn't climb down that. Maybe I could find a way to drain the putrid water. Okay, so you can't do anything with that yet. Oh, blood marks from where the knife was. I was carrying that gun and this knife. I was worried what the police might think if they saw me. <laughs> Oops. Okay, nope. Wasn't sure, but I thought it was some kind of regulator. I had no idea how it works. Through the dust, I could see handprints from previous use, probably from whoever worked in those sewers. I thought I could turn this water valve to shut off its flow. Did I turn it? Yep. <coughs> Looked like I turned it off already. Okay. Okay. That sounded kind of different from the other one. Oh, still active. Okay, there we go. Damn. Okay, that's those. Uh, excuse me. Nope, so locked. drain out of that grate in the wall. Hmm. There was a small metal key left floating in the shallow pool of rancid water. Did I take it? Yep. I pocketed the small key, but it was so odd shaped I had no idea what it might be open. The safety poster had definitely seen better days. How old was that facility? The faded paper was yellow and dusty, but there had been obvious but it had obviously been wiped off recently. 
no. Oh. Oh. Of course it's another body. Of course it is. Why not? I found another dead body. A sewer worker. By the wounds all over his face and body, I figured he'd been stabbed repeatedly. Um... Probably with the knife that you picked up earlier. But the key, there was a key ring sticking out of the man's pocket. Did I take it? Thought about the knife I'd found with some disgust as I carefully picked the keys from his pocket. I was almost worried he was going to grab me. Feeling even more sick from seeing another dead man. I didn't want to get any more blood on my clothes. Wait. There was a security camera in the room. There must have been a way. Wait, there must have been a way to see what happened. Maybe the VHS tape I found could be useful. I couldn't help but wonder if someone was watching me from the other side. Use the key to unlock the door. Oh, there we go. But I don't think that's the, the other door that I was thinking of. The shelf full of security tapes was strictly organized, though covered in dust. Looked like the tape I found was one that was missing from the shelf. I wonder what was on the tape and why it was thrown out. I don't fucking know. There's a dusty VCR on the security desk. I wonder what was on the VHS tape I found. Did I play it? Mm -hmm. uh, okay, that was kind of loud. Video showed a man right there in the sewers being attacked. The tape looked fuzzy and stretched like somebody had tampered with it. Look like there could have been two men. I could stand to watch that video again. Ah, shit. This one? Yep. Tried a bunch of the keys on the key ring I had found on that sewer worker, and one of them seemed to fit. A collection of stale liquor bottles covered the floor. That room didn't seem like much of a place for drinking. What was the, what was the point? The wall was littered with dozens of old faded papers. Whoever did this was obsessed with some local murders. According to some of the clippings, bodies have been found in ravines, in the forest, and in one case, dumped in the back of an abandoned truck. Couldn't be sure, but I thought some of the same articles had always been pasted up back in those tunnels. Did that sewer worker find this room? Is that why he was killed? A faded receipt was half trampled on the floor. It was from the local train station. It was for two tickets. Didn't know what it was, what it could be for. What use it could be, but did I keep it? Why not? You picked up everything else you found. I neatly folded the soil receipt and slipped it in my front pocket. Nope. Yeah. God damn it. Son of a bitch. The other room that I just passed up, that was the taped thing with the thing. This must have been the other end of that ventilation shaft. Whoever used it could have gotten past a flooded room with this. Clever, but why go through all the trouble? So you don't get wet and all that other stuff? Would I need that gun or that knife before the end? Both weighed me down and aggravated my leg as I climbed that old ladder. The thought of that videotape still gave me chills. Who was it? Wait, who was it they didn't want to be seen? Was it the same person that hid all those clippings away in that locked room? Suddenly, the awful smell of the sewer gave way to a pine scented blast of fresh air. Yay, I'm out of those goddamn sewers. Okay, when we come back, I will explore uh, pine fresh goodness or the woods or forest or something. We'll find out. 
So until then, this is Save Night on Let's Play Home. Later, guys.